Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today is a collab with my beautiful friend Bridget of Beauty Goddess Bridget over here on YouTube. Um, Bridget is wonderful and I will talk more about her as we get into this. We decided to collab with the Kaleidos Club Nebula palette. So this is the collaboration with Angelica Nikvist and oh, I love this so much so I am so happy with collabing with this and I was the one that had to pick the five shades and my random number generator was obviously in a bad mood that day so we first have rock hopper on there and then gravity and then samus and Cylon and lastly Nova so four mattes and one shimmer I'm just going to swatch them out so here is rock hopper and then gravity and Samus and then Cylon Okay, 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 okay. I haven't actually swatched these out before this. Crazy. Um, so yes, the one shimmer we have is Nova and this here is Nova. So this is our colour story, colour palette we're playing with. Um, yeah. So it's going to be very interesting, um, but I'd rather four mats and one shimmer than the other way around. So I am not going to complain. I'm going to just, it, it is what it is. Right, so I am going to first go in with Rock Hopper, this one. So me and Bridget have collabed before. Um, I the most recent one was with Marina also, and it was with the uh, Nomad Haunted Europe palette. And I will, if I remember, either link it in the description box or up in the cards. Um, I can't promise that. I will remember because my memory is shocking these days absolutely shocking um but yeah i first met bridget um in the comment sections of both other people's other content creators videos and also she has been a subscriber of mine for a long time now right since the beginning and I am over the moon now to be a subscriber of her channel um, Bridget does a lot of different content like hauls um, she also does Facebook lives and she's always posting on Instagram so I will I will link Bridget's channel um, a video if I remember to ask in time um, and also Instagram for you to check out oh this color this palette is just amazing it is such a beautiful beautiful palette yeah Bridget is a one of a kind she is such a wonderful human being um, and yeah, there, there aren't really words to describe Bridget. Bridget is Bridget and I love her so much. We have become really good friends. Um, well, I'd say through makeup, but also I know Bridget was very, very poorly not long ago. And I'm sure if you already follow her, or are already subscribed you will know that she had COVID and she was so poorly 
in hospital and it wasn't just the covid i believe that was what was making her so poorly um but yeah scary times she is a fighter and a trooper and one hell of a character and i love her so much and i'm just proud to call her my friend my sister from another mister yeah just dragging this out a bit further so i'm next going in with cylon and i'm going to use that to deepen up the crease and take it outwards but i'm going to be doing a cut crease a proper cut crease which i don't often do anymore i don't know why i just seem to pick the kind of lazy option i'm so going to be playing with this palette again i think this palette is one that if i didn't have a channel this would be used probably more regular this would definitely be one that i would hold on to if i were to have to cut down to a normal person's amount of uh, shadows um shadows palettes so for me as if you are not new you will know i am a huge green lover that is my my color um for bridget it is red and red is her number one and it really suits her so i'm going to quickly cut my crease and then i'll be back to continue so just a moment okay guys so i'm back i've cut my crease using the p louise base in rumor zero and um, the white one and then i went in with the lowest cosmetics liquid eyeshadow the easy rain liquid eyeshadow in the shade throne i love it and i thought it went perfectly and it's not cheating because it's not an eyeshadow so i am going to what am i going to do so i'm quickly going to pat down and make sure that we don't have creases i haven't done a cut crease like this in a long time this is so much fun right so first i'm going to go in with the only shimmer that we have which is nova and I am going to place that on the inner part here. I just want it for this very, very inner part because I have the plan for the rest, which I'm hoping will come together nicely but we shall see so this is such a beautiful shimmer um this is more what i would call topper or inner corner highlight but i think over the white base this is looking really pretty this shade is beautiful i don't know how well it will be showing up on camera but this looks so pretty very beautiful right now i'm hoping that this is going to look good um but we'll see i'm going in with gravity 
the green and I'm going to take that on the outer part here I'm going to tap it into the shimmer there slightly and we'll go back over with the shimmer so yeah Bridget does a lot of colourful looks she is another a fellow older person we're in the older category the over 40s and she is just amazing i love her we both have quite a passion for nomad cosmetics also as, as well as uh, kaleidos i don't know how many palettes from kaleidos that bridget has yeah we're not doing too bad here okay so just same here just packing this on okay and then back in with nova i'm just going to kind of bring nova more across the green there gravity that is so pretty oh this is going all right Actually, I'm going to bring the green more out. I was going to put kind of a deepening shade, but I don't think I want to do that. So I will clean this up afterwards. I can't wait to see what Bridget has done with these colours. I know she's the same as me and likes a lot of shimmers um, but I don't know how she feels with regards to there being only one shimmer for me I'm just glad it wasn't just one map Okay, so I'm now going to nip off and finish my face apart from the lower lash line, which I will come back to do with you. So just stay where you are. Okay, guys, so I have finished everything but the lower lash line and we only have one shade left to use and that is Samus. So it is going to have to... Oh, <laughs> so it's going to have to go um, because, yeah, I've got to use that. I'm just going to take that, yeah it's going to go, I'm just using that on my lower lash line just to, uh, well make sure it's added actually, that's quite nice, okay, this isn't a colour combination, well I don't know is it, I don't know, it's looking good though, Ooh, okay. So now everything that I have popped on my face will be listed in the description box below uh, for if you want to check that out. The winged liner is one of the water activated liners, cake it liners from Artitude Cosmetics and it is in the shade Admire. I absolutely love this. The lashes are also from Artichoux Cosmetics, but they're from the Lucky Dip. So they don't have a name. But I think they go perfectly. I'm so excited to, uh, to see what Bridget does. 
funnily enough she messaged me um just a moment ago so i will have to get back to her in a moment it might just make that a little bit more prominent This is really nice. Oh, that looks so good. Right, I'm nearly done. I just want to. I'm going to go back in with Nova and I'm just going to pop some of that on the inner part of my lower lash line here I think that'll tie it all in together nicely oh yeah this is looking so nice I love it I think this is possibly my favourite look I've ever done at least one of possibly the best yep i am super happy with that so let me just grab my mascara so i'm just going to pop on the mascara and then i'll come back and we'll have a chat and say goodbye so just stay where you are okay guys so this is the look completed i had so much fun i'm so happy that Bridget suggested we do a palette bingo. I haven't done one in a long time. I think I may have to just start doing some more just to encourage me to mix shades that I say I wouldn't usually, that I hadn't thought of mixing. Um, but yeah, I had so much fun and I am so happy with the look and so excited to see what Bridget's done with these shades. I know it's gonna be fun. Her videos are always so much fun. You really need to go check her out if you haven't already. I will have her her channel, her Instagram, and her collab video. Um, I will have that all linked in the description box below. Please go check her out. She is so much fun and I love her. So Bridget, thank you so much for collabing with me again. I love it when we collab it's always so much fun so yeah i think i think that's it let me know what you think of the look in the description box below how do you think i did i'm happy with it anyways <laughs> um so if you have liked this video please don't forget to give it a like because that really helps me out um if you are new or if you're over from bridges channel hi i'm steph i love colorful makeup i love supporting indie brands i only use cruelty free makeup so yeah if that all sounds like something you'd be interested in then please do hit the subscribe button and just join the family because we have a lot of fun so thank you so much for joining me today i hope you're all having a great day great evening wherever you are and whatever you're doing i hope you're taking care of yourselves I will see you again very, very soon. Bye.